my inspiration came from the Little Red Riding Hood fairy tales. In my version, I would like to give a new interpretation with a little twist. There is a main Red Riding Hood and there is a main wolf, but all of the other characters are interpreting a different feeling and emotion from the main character. And then the wolf really presenting the society problem, fears and frustration from her. And basically she creating the wolf to herself. And through the story, I would like to show this conflict between them. Well, my piece is called Wanted and it's about Bonnie and Clyde. And I first got the idea to use that as a choreography from a piece of music I found. I found out that it was originally used in a Bonnie and Clyde movie as the getaway scene. So that became the boy's solo and he's running around trying to escape the whole time. And then I found another piece of music which is very romantic and I used that for the pas de deux. And then I found a poem which Bonnie Parker wrote a couple weeks before they died. And it's about their life on the road and trying to survive. And I made a recording of that and that became the women's solo. I decided for Bach, Toccata and Fuga because since I was a little child and my grandmother took me to church, I loved the uh, organs and it was always kind of my wish to create an organ. And I find it very nice to mix it with a cello duet from Bach as well. So my choreography name is uh, Sen Nur Achfunzen and Sen in my language means dream. It's about a guy who are having this Nur Achfunzen life going home and fell asleep and he's having dreams. So we basically go into this dancer's head. We see what is happening during the sleeping. So I hope it will work and I will like it. The title of my piece is Fall No Further. The inspiration comes from being a woman and sort of having to navigate a man's world and what that feels like and kind of what that looks like. Relationships between people have always been very interesting to me and it was important for myself to kind of explore what that would look like through dance. So the music is a beat collage. I chose it because it's a bit monotonous, so it was easier for me to have the feelings of the people come across rather than it being overpowered by the music, but it's still being able to portray what I needed to portray. In my piece called Shadows, I wish to explore or present an inner dialogue between three different voices that happens in the same head. Uh, one is the voice of creativity, artistic voice, something that is a little bit behind words. Another voice is more something represent home and femininity and ground. And the third voice is the voice of the ego, the center, something that is in between those two different voices. My choice of music is two different tracks from Mark Eliyahu, he's an Israeli composer. And I chose this music because, first of all, it reminds me home. <laughs> and a lot of longing. There is something in the music that provoke this emotion of longing to something. It touches exactly the spot that I wish to provoke in my piece. The name of the piece is Like a Dog with Two Tails, which comes from the English idiom, I'm happy like a dog with two tails. And like the title, I would like the piece to give the spectators the same extreme joy and happiness. 
It's the search for freedom, and with freedom I mean the freedom of a child dancing and moving without the fear of being judged, feeling raw powerful emotions, unfiltered emotions. And I would really like with my piece to encourage the whole public and the viewers to have more of these moments, to feel more the freedom and the weirdness in the best possible way. Oh